morning, Huskies. I'm your principal, Mrs. Diaz Avery. And I'm that one guy. And welcome, welcome to, to the, the Husky, Husky News. News. How Huskies, I am excited to start a new school year with all of you and I cannot wait to see the incredible things we do as a school and as a community. Ms. Diaz Avery, we are so excited and honored to have you here at our school. Uh, students, it is a new year and so there are a lot of changes. We know change can be difficult, but it's part of life. And these changes are here to help ensure everyone is safe and feels like they belong here at Howe Middle School. <music> Students, please place your schedule in the front cover of your binder. It is very common for students to misplace or possibly lose their binders. If your schedule is in the front cover, then we can quickly return it to you. Please remember to walk on the right side of the hallways. This way, everyone can get to class without bumping into each other or causing traffic. And please remember to walk and talk if you're with your friends. If you stand in the middle of the hallway, it creates traffic for everybody. Students need a sign hall pass to use the bathrooms and to come to the health room. If you are seen in the hallways without a pass, you will be sent back to class. Just a reminder that this year, hoods, beanies, and hats must be put away. This is an important step in preventing strangers from entering our school and keeping students safe. So this one is probably the hardest change, but we are a no electronic device district. This means that every Salem-Kaiser school does not allow personal devices during school hours. If a teacher sees you with a phone, headphones or earbuds or a personal device or gaming device, uh, they will ask you to put it away. This will be considered strike one. On strike two, your device will be sent to the office. You can still pick it up after school, but your parents will be notified that it was taken. And then on strike three, your device will be sent to the office, but only your parents can pick it up until 4.30. Yearbooks are already on sale! Yes, you can purchase them for $18. It's best to buy them soon, because in January, the price will increase. Mm. Now, due to construction, the library is currently closed but the library will reopen Monday, October 31st for Halloween. <laughs> the new transportation opportunity is now available to all students. Students can now ride the Chariots City Bus for free, but you must have a pass. To get more information on how to receive your pass, please see Ms. Fryer in the Students Activity Center before or after school. Until next time, I'm Mrs. Diaz Avery. And I'm that one guy. Have, Have a good, good week, Huskies. Huskies. Mrs. Diaz Avery. And I'm Mr. Bailey. And Have, Have a good, good week, Huskies. Huskies. Listen, listen. I put an and in the bed. Just a reminder that this year, Hoods, beanies, and hats must be, be put away. You want to say that one more time? <laughs>